celebrating anniversaries at the library. Um, this year, uh, born in London in probably 1343, Geoffrey Chaucer. This is his uh, 670th birthday, anniversary of his birthday. He was the first writer interred in Poets' Corner in Westminster Abbey. And though he was not given any money from King Edward III uh, for his poetry, he was given a gallon of wine a day. Uh, if I were given a gallon of wine today, I couldn't either write a wine or read it. <laughs> um, I'm going to read from uh, the opening of the Canterbury Tales. Uh, and the first line, given today's weather in Bozeman, is a kind of wishful thinking. But it is England. Uh, no, but listen. Quand that April with the sure sorta, the drucht of March hath perced to the lota, and bathed every vein in switch the court of which were to engender it is the floor. One Zephyrus egg with his sweet of breath in spirit hot in every hope and hearth the tender crops, and the younger son hath in the ram his halva court sirona. And smaller foolish mocking melody that slate and all the nicht with open ear. So pricketh them natur and her courages. Than long and folk to go on pilgrimages, and palmerus for to go on to second strange strandus, to fair the halvus couth in sundry landus. And specially from every sheeres end of Engeland to Canterbury they wend. The holy blissful mark for to say again, that him hath opened when that they were sick. Befell that in that season on a day in Southwark at the tavern as he lay, ready to wend in on me pilgrimage, to Canterbury with full devout courage. At night was come unto that hostelry well nean and twenty in a company of sundry folk. The aventure fall in fellowship, and pilgrimus were they all, that toward Canterbury wolden vida. The chambres and the stables were in weeda, and well we were in azed at the best. And shortly, when the sun was to rest, so had he spoken with him every one, that he was of her fellowship anon, and mod for word early for Teresa, to talk or way there as he knew to be But not the less will he have team and spasa ere that he further in this talapasa. They think it did a cordon to resume to tell you all the condition of each of them, so as it same in May, and which they were in, and of what the gray. And at a knicht, then will he first begin. A knicht there was, and that a worthy that ever throw the team of that he first begun to read out, he loved chivalry, truth, and honor, freedom, and courtesy. For worthy was he in his lordes where, and thereto had he read no man fairer, as well in Christendom as in heaviness, and ever honored for his worthiness. At Alessandra he was when it was one. For off the team he had the border begone above and all in nations in Prus. In Leto had he raised it and in Bruce. No Christian man so off of his degree. In Gernot at the sage he had a bay of Al Khazir and the Redin in Bel Maria. At Lies was he and at Sartoria when they were one. And in the great to say of money and noble army had he bay. At mortal battles had he been fifteen, and fuchten for our faith at Ramesine and Listus Dries, and a slain his foe. His ilka worthy knicht had been also some teamer with the Lord of Palatia, again another haven in Turkey. And evermore he had a sovereign priest, and though that he were worthy, he was least. And of his port as may as is a maid. He never yet no villainy said in all his leaf unto no manner weed. He was a very parfit, genteel knight. But for to tell you of his array, his horse were good, but he was not gay. A 
fustian he wearied age home, all besmutted with his other John. For he was Lati Coma from his Biagia, and went forth to dawn his pilgrimage. Mm -hmm.